having trouble joining your buddies in CS2 because the community servers won't load? No sweat, I've got your back. In this video, I'll walk you through fixing this snag so you can get back to fragging in CS2 in no time. Let's jump straight into the solutions. Solution 1. Reset your network configuration settings. First off, click on the search icon here and type in CMD. Then, right click on command prompt, select run as administrator and click yes. Now, type at sh winsock reset and hit enter. Next, type ipconfig slash flush dns and hit enter. After that, type ipconfig slash release and hit enter. Now, type ipconfig slash renew and press enter. Following that, type in net sh ip reset and hit enter. Don't fret, I'll list all these commands in the video description below. Lastly, restart your computer and your router. After that, check if the error is gone. Solution 2. Run Steam as an administrator. To start, right click on the taskbar and select Task Manager. Then in the search bar here, type in Steam. Next, right click on Steam 32-bit and select End Task from the context menu. After that, close the Task Manager. Now right click on the Steam shortcut on your desktop and select Run as Administrator. Click on Yes to give permission. Now check if the issue is resolved. Solution 3. Verify and Repair CS2 Begin by clicking on the system tray icon. Then right click on Steam and select Exit Steam. Once that's done, open up File Explorer. Navigate to your C drive. Then open the Program Files x86 folder followed by the Steam folder. Next, go to the user data folder and then to the folder with the numbers. From here, delete the 730 folder and close the window. Now reopen Steam. Head to the library. Right click on Counter Strike 2 from the left side menu and select properties. Click on install the files. Now click the verify integrity of game files button. Steam will begin verifying and repairing the game. After that, the issue should be resolved. So that's how you can fix the issue of community servers not loading in CS2 on your computer. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit that like button. Have any questions? Drop them in the comments and I'll get back to you real soon. Thanks for watching.